everybody. Saturday, November the 3rd here in New Orleans. Uh, I like to call this installment of the NOLA Criminal Law Podcast. Monday Night Football, Tuesday Morning Blues. Uh, got a big Monday Night Football game here in New Orleans this weekend, or this Monday night. And uh, for a few select individuals, uh, that could lead to a, a pretty ugly Tuesday morning. You know, let me talk for just a few minutes uh, about uh, the varieties of uh, incidences that people can expect to encounter uh, after a Monday night football game. Talking first of all about the alcohol and drug related crimes, uh, DWI, drug possession charges. Talking about the straight party related crimes, drunken public, disturbing the peace. Uh, first of all, for any felony charge, that is uh, any drug offense other than uh, possession of marijuana, you will be arrested. Uh, any DWI, driving while intoxicated, driving under the influence of drugs, uh, you're going to be arrested for that. Public intoxication, you're going to be arrested for that even though it's just a misdemeanor. Like fighting, simple battery type charges, really depends on the seriousness of the battery. If you're talking about a very serious fight, someone's injured, uh, uh, a bad fight, uh, you could get arrested for battery and charged in state court. Uh, a, a less serious fight, is uh, something that you can be cited for and, and get a summons to appear in court. The difference between being arrested and receiving a summons is that if you're arrested, you're actually taken to jail. If you're given a summons, it's actually just like getting a traffic ticket. You'll get the, a ticket. It'll command you to appear in court uh, normally within the uh, few days after you receive the summons. So the summonsable offenses are things like the less serious batteries, possession of marijuana, uh, disturbing the peace, uh, lewd conduct, that's the peeing on the street. What that means is uh, that you're going to get a ticket. It's going to give you uh, uh, a court date where you're going to have to appear. That's going to raise some issues for a lot of people because a lot of people are going to be in town for the game only, flying out the next day, maybe flying out a couple days later. Um, so you do have to make an appearance uh, or have an attorney appear for you. So if you uh, are from out of town, and you want to hire someone to handle the case for you, uh, the very strong chance is that you're going to be able to get someone who can appear in court for you and you can go on back home and, and handle your business. There's a good bit of information about that uh, on my website, so you know, please uh, check that specific link out for uh, folks that are here from, from out of town. Um, you are arrested. Regardless of what you're arrested for, you're going to want to probably get an, a local attorney involved to help you out. Again, there's lots of information about that on my website as well. Um, I, I do welcome all the Eagles fans into town. Um, I'm pulling for the Saints, obviously. Um, but I hope everybody has a great time. Enjoy Monday night, and, and, and I hope you don't wind up with the Tuesday morning hangover. Thanks for watching.